Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Today I'm going to be doing a mythic draw for Blake Griffin and CP3. I am working on the Houston server number 3. Um, I am on all 5 servers as iPod King Carter. But uh, today I noticed that um, I got a big kickback from the update for NBA All Net. And I have over 20,000 diamonds. So um, what I'm going to be doing here is a uh, mythic draw because right now I have blake and cp3 in my lineup but why not go mythic um this is going to be my first mythic draw ever i missed out on vince carter lebron james Shaq, kobe all on my other servers because i didn't have enough diamonds and when i was going through the update i was like yo i got a, a crazy amount of diamonds so today i'm going to be doing that now uh let me show you guys something real quick if i go to evolution and i select the card to evolve um my boy CP3 is already at max evolution um, and is missing one rank. And uh, Blade Griffin is maxed out on rank but uh, is in need of catalyst. So, uh, yeah, man. I'm giving him up right here, right now. So, uh, let's hop into it. Uh, now, for each draw, you get 25 pieces of CP3. And for Blake, you get 30 pieces. So, I am really going to run out of all of my diamonds doing this but i will have enough pieces to make a card for each guy so uh let's go into cp3 first all right now the best thing about this i guess you could say is that i will most likely get let's say uh, a, a couple good cards out of this so um i'm gonna hit continue i'm not gonna hit draft again I, because i want to make sure that i drafted the right amount of pieces so uh, here we have Stoudemire out of it. Not a bad card, but uh, we have 25 pieces for CP3. Now uh, let me draft them one more time to get 75 pieces if I don't get them here. All right, I didn't get them there, but I'm gonna take Tony Parker. Let's see. Now if I go back, let's see. Let's see how many pieces I need to complete a card. So uh, pieces and... I need 300 pieces now I have 30 universal pieces but I'm gonna probably use those for Blake knowing that I'm probably gonna run out so I have to get 300 pieces here so uh let's see let's go back and let's keep drawing let's see what we get here all right hopefully I get a CV3 before I get to 300 pieces because all of my diamonds are gonna be gone now uh let's see draft that now i have to draft cp3 12 times in order to get all of the pieces for his card so let's go through that it's five let's see i'm i know for sure that these these type of draws nowadays you don't get them at all and i respect that you know for the mythic draws because you know we don't want everybody running around with mythic cards but it does take a lot out of you to get these pieces. So let's see, that's seven. Where are we? All right, so after I draft this, I get 25 more pieces. This will make 200 pieces. Let's see. Okay. All right, now my pieces are, are wearing thin. I'm already down to 16,000 diamonds, but I only have to draw four more. Now, uh, now I'm down to three. All right, let's see. All right, now just two more draws and then I'll have all the pieces for a mythic CP3. Now, I will tell you guys, after I draft all of, uh, and, and evolve this dude into uh, a card, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna see if I can actually put him in my lineup and use my other CP3 as a catalyst. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna try it, why not? All right, so let's see, I'm gonna take Paul Gasol there. All right, now. I have all the necessary pieces for a CP3 card, so we're going to hop right into it. I'm not going to waste your time here. All right, I'm going to combine. I'm going to get this uh, Mythic CP3. Ooh, look at that, 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 look at that. All right, so let me go back to roster. Now, uh, let's check out the card's details, man. Okay, so starting out, it's not that bad. Um... Catalyst bonus is of course zero, but his offense is a B, defense is a B, and his tech is a A. I have no problem with that. Um, his chemistry is still aerial artist, and he gets 
more skills. Look at this. Let me see. Now, he already has a, a skill of level 1 composure. Plus 100 permanent increase to control stat. Look at that. All right. Counterattack at rank 8. And Amplify is at uh, rank 4. So, let me check out my regular CP3 card and show you guys his details. Look at this. Uh, this is Swipe. He still has counterattack and he has composure at level four. So that's not that bad, but check out this CP3 stats right here, yo. These stats is insane. But um, let me see if I can go back and put him into said lineup. Now look at this, I got a whole bunch of Chris Pauls for Catalyst, yo. But he was already at max evolution, so. Let me see what I got here. Let's see if we can uh, get some evolution going for CP3, let's see. All right, so if I put the Mythic up and I add Catalyst, you can't add any Catalyst unless they are Mythic cards. So it's gonna totally suck that I'm not gonna have any bump percentages because, you know, it's all good though. Maybe, you know, if I do get some diamonds or something like that or some, you know, like a kickback or something to another update, things will go get well, but it's all good. So here, I'm gonna start drafting Blake. Let's see what we got here, 74. Now the thing is, since I don't have to use my rank eight CP3, I'm gonna keep him in the lineup until I build up this uh, Mythic CP3 and Blake. Now this is my third draw. Let's see. All right, come on, keep going. This is my fourth. Now, I can't remember, how many pieces does it take to get a Mythic Blake? Let's see. Let's just go to continue, go down, cards. I wanna see how many pieces it takes for a Blake. Okay, it takes 300 pieces as well, and he already has 30 pieces, so I'm already at 150. So um, I'm not actually gonna run out of diamonds here, so let's keep going. All right, 150 now. 180. Okay. Now, what's that? 210. Alright, got a Darren Williams out of that. Alright, 240. Got another Darren Williams. Alright, and draft one more time. Where was I at? Was I at 210 or 240? I think I was at 240, so this makes 270. But I am gonna check. I am gonna check. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna botch this and keep spinning diamonds. <laughs> so pieces. Okay, yeah, I'm at 270 now. And last but not least, last draw for Blake Griffin. We have a winner. Okay, so Tony Parker gets drafted, and I get all the pieces necessarily needed for Blake. So let's go ahead and uh grab this card right here so I'm gonna go ahead and combine all of my card pieces for this good old Blake alright so now I have Blake Griffin mythic CP3 mythic let's check out his stats real quick let's see alright aerial artist as well eruption attempted dunk 60% chance for additional one point assailant okay 20 percent permanent increase to dunk and field goal that's cool aggression 100 permanent increase to dunk stat okay so that's golden um i'm probably going to put these guys in my lineup soon but what i definitely want to do i want to see what i can do to evolve this blake and the cp3 so i have a couple pieces that i could put together but i got a lot of work to do on this server um this server is definitely one of my better servers but let me see let me go in and, and check out my uh, ally list real quick all right so I'm at level 60 right and the highest person on my list is a 54 maybe Here's a dope jam. yeah the highest person on my list is I think a 54 no 57 so I'm three ahead of this guy and his last login was a day ago so he's definitely one of those people that plays this game a lot like me now um, what I'm gonna do is uh, going to put these guys in my lineup what I'm actually gonna do though truthfully I'm probably gonna just upgrade them and let, let me show you guys what I mean by that 
I'm going to transfer XP from one card to another. So if I want to use a Mythic, I'm going to probably use... Where's my other CP3 at? Okay. Alright, so it's going to take me 7 XP uh, slips to get him to level 55. But if I want to use 7 regular, I can get him to level 47 and just uh, grind it out. Now, um, I will say that it's probably going to be hard for me to rank them up because the emeralds and stuff let me see how many emeralds i got rank up okay i have a hundred i have 110 rubies and 40 emeralds but you know what i didn't do i didn't use none of those tokens that i got from uh that all-star weekend i botched that entire thing didn't i let me don't tell me i botched it special okay okay here we go here we go here we go here we go okay so i got 24 pieces and I can use those for rubies and everything. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna should I use universal pieces, for mythic cards, or should I go right after mythic pieces? Now I'm go, I'm not gonna go after mythic pieces. I'm gonna go after what I need because I'm not I'm not I'm not a weirdo. I know I know what I need. Let me see. So 20. Okay, three. There we go. All right. So I have four all star tokens that I cannot use. But that's all right. Um, I have more rubies, as well as in Road to Glory, I get to level 71 whenever I want, um, and I put that on autoplay. So let's see. Let's go down to 40 wins, 60 wins, all right, 80 wins. Okay, so I can exchange 80 wins for rubies. But what I'm gonna need a, a stockpile of is emeralds that's what i'm gonna need mainly because i think I, I think topaz are pretty cheap so all right um i'm gonna get up out of here guys uh i will put these dudes in my lineup though i'm just gonna put them in there just so i know that these are the cards that i'm gonna be using now it wants me to replace what with what oh it's probably wants me to play replace that with tim duncan but that'll be a waste of my time seeing as though i have uh chemistry with darren williams and uh kevin garnett so it looks pretty good seeing these mythic guys in my lineup. Um, let's see, who else is that small forward? Nobody. <laughs> All right, this is IKC signing out. Appreciate you guys for listening, and I'm gonna highlight you guys in the next one. Peace. Bring the